Welcome to Apex Comics. Well, YouTube has actually changed its functions. I used to be able to record video from YouTube, but now I'm using Movie Maker and I got to download it to YouTube. So thanks YouTube for putting an extra step in my kink. Yeah, just what I really need. Not... Anyway, I've got a package. Mile High Comics, baby. I'm sorry, Lone Star Comics. Can I not read? There we go. Let's see what I got. Let's see what I have. Ah, oh, mercy me. YouTube changes. Boy, aren't they special. I've been going through the live chats this weekend, and there's Google bots doing their little policing. Unnecessary policing, if you ask me. Oh, just don't say anything political. Oh, no. Don't talk about the orange man. Oh, no. Don't talk about Bo Jiden. <laughs> Bo Jiden. Hey. Bo Jiden. Ah. <laughs> uh, let's see. Go back to your basement, Bo Jiden. Bo Jiden, Bo Jiden. A man I cannot stand. Bo Jiden, Bo Jiden. No one else can. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I think I'd do some fun, some Bo Jaden cartoons. Get a good animation program, be all nice and awesome. Holy mackerel, giant size Dracula number two. Hey, I may have. I think I have another one of that. Oh, sweet. John says, Master of Kung Fu, number four. John says, Man Thing, number two. It's like, uh, is a man, man thing at the movies? <laughs> Tearing up the screen, that's pretty fun. I like that. Wow, that's pretty cool. Damn, I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued. What if Man Thing and Shang Chi and Dracula teamed up? Man Thing, Shang Chi, and Dracula walk into a bar. What happens next? Only the reader will know. All right, let's take a look at Man Thing. Wow, it's so bright. Hmm. Oh, sure. Well, the dilly dilly. Just, excuse my non special effect camera. Oh, take a look, shall we? Monsters and men. Sweet. Let's. Kind of a little closer. Man, okay, we got John Buscema, Klaus Jansen, Steve Gerber writing, of course. John Costanza letters. Uh, Linda Lesman colors. Roy Thomas edit. Uh, yeah. Got some great Buscema work. I really admire his stuff, man. And don't know really what the story is, so I'm just gonna go through it. Kind of, whoa! This guy's a threat. He's gonna shoot someone. Man, things like, no, nope, not gonna happen. And oh, <laughs> I guess it must be a sheriff. Some weird stuff happening. Oh man. The high cost of vengeance. I think it looks like they're they're in the uh, uh, massive telephone campaign. Uh, this is about politics, major research, every major research corporation, and foundation in the United States of so some kind of a meeting. Okay, swamp. Uh, looking for some uh, some evidence. 
What could be a good researcher? Ted Salas used to be a researcher, a scientist. Some of his brain can actually know what's going on. Whoa! Somehow... I guess a man thing is being captured for research or something. Wow, it's crazy. Oh, they got the thing. Ben Graham involved. Oh, wow, how cool is that? Could be an excerpt for uh, Marvel 201 number one, which I do have. Man thing, New York adventure. So he's displayed in New York. It's like, hell of this. I'm not going to be displayed just for show. I'm out of here. Ah. Very great detail. What's, oh, what's, oh, what's all that? Oh. oh, man. Dracula lives. There we go. Get the black and white magazines. I wish Marvel would come back with some new black and white magazines without being so woke. Oh, we got a backup feature of a blip. The blip. It's a Jack Kirby classic from the late 50s, early 60s, I suppose. Yeah. He stalks by night. Get some little features here. Good issue. Ah, uh, I think we went over Dracula number two. Giant says, Master Hong Kong fool. Yeah. Well, who draws it? No, we'll find out. Someone on eBay was going to charge $39 for this. So I got this, like, very fine for, like, like 16 Ah, huh. It's pretty good shape, man. Wow, look at that. Hardly any wear and tear on this baby. It's like, God looks like a near mint. Gosh, off white. It's, yeah, it's really good. Why a tiger claw? Oh, I don't know why. Well, who draws this? Oh, Keith Pollard, Sop Trapini Inks. Uh, Doug Mench, right? Wrote it. Len Wein, editor. Janice Cohen, colors. Featuring supporting characters created by Sax Romer. Yeah. This is from 1975. They've been putting out a lot of Giant Science comics in 74, 75. I think 76. I'm not too certain. But anyway. There was some little martial arts action. A little homage to Bruce Lee, like the Bruce Lee look out there. I like that. Oh, we got Fu Manchu. Ooh. And there's a tiger claw. It must be an assassin. Uh, parents of Tiger Claw. Now uh, to go up against these guys. It's a crap out of all of them. Yeah. They all face each other. Whoa. Okay. Back sand. Oh. Boom. Good melee. I'm not going to go into it. But you get Yellow Claw Classic. You know, Steel. Well, it brings up a thousand foot tall. Man, who was a thousand feet tall? Oh. So. Some kind of weird experiment. Wow, it's nuts. Well, Jack Kirby art. Jack Kirby, man. I gotta love him. Great stuff. A thousand feet tall. Oh, he's going to try to rule the world with this guy, but there you have it. Please like, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. It's your old boy, Perks Comics. You guys have a beautiful, wonderful,
great day. One ciao for now.